Hey, are you interested in being amazing, being fulfilled, having a skill set to help you understand how you feel, what you feel, and how you can use the same skill set to create rapport, connection, and influence with the people that you love most in life? If that's a yes for you, just comment, yes, that's me. And what I'm going to invite you to consider is this. What I'm about to share with you is, is the most potent skill set I've ever come across. Out of all the things I've been blessed to know and learn and be a student of, this is the number one thing I use to help my high level performing clients and I'm gonna share it with you for free. So here we go. Number one, are you checking in with yourself frequently? Do you know what you feel? Did you know that every time you're itching or scratching or you have a stutter that your emotional body is attempting to communicate to you? Did you know that? If you knew that, just comment, I knew that. If you did not, just comment, whatever you choose to, just to let me know where you're at so I can communicate with you. Here's the next thing. Every time you're itching or scratching or you have a pain or a symptom or a disease or a discomfort, that is emotional data. Just like on the dashboard of your car, you have a gas gauge, a fuel gauge, a battery gauge, RPMs, all of that fun stuff. That is a tool or an instrument to help you understand what's going on in your vehicle. Your body's the same way, exactly the same way. Every area of your body means something different. Feet are about understanding. If it's the bottom of your foot, it's about you. If it's the top of your foot, it's about others. Right side is male figure, left side is female figure. I'm giving you a very high level view. There's more intricate pieces. I'm just giving you some things to open some files, so to speak, so you can get some ahas or some new understanding about why something could be showing up in your life. Okay, now, if you're tight in your stomach, that's where fear shows up. If you're tight in your chest or your throat, that's where sorrow shows up. If you're tight in your back or your neck, this is where anger shows up or burden shows up or resentment or frustration shows up. It's showing up to let you know that your emotional body has something that it has not processed. And when you don't process it, remember this. Hear me out. Feelings buried alive never die. Which means if there's things that start showing up in your life in the form of people, circumstances, situations, and events that create certain feelings... Once you can get clear on what feeling is active in your body, you will now see a reflection of what feelings are being produced by your external events. Life is a mirror. There's only one of us here. The scripture says, if ye are not one, ye are not mine, which means when you see something else in someone, there is an extremely high probability that that thing that you see is the very thing that you are doing. One of my coaches, Mr. Chris Stubbs, says, if you caught it, you got it. This is what I learned in the jungle, Cancun, Mexico in 2015 for about seven or eight days doing emotional processing work. And I came across that tool. He said, if you caught it, you got it. Great tool. If you got some value out of this, please share it. If there's a question that you have, please share it. If there's a way that I may support you, shoot me a message and I'll be happy to do so. Have an amazing day. And remember, if you don't make time for your wellness, you will make time for your illness. Bye.